Welcome back to Yoga Express, your virtual stretch clinic that helps you move the body to still the mind. My name is Banam Suresh. I'm your host for this program. Yoga Express airs Monday through Friday on Time 157, RCN 84, and Fios 35 at 1.30 Eastern Standard Time. If you do not have a TV set in front of you, feel free to go online, mnn.org, that stands for Manhattan Neighborhood Network, which is where we film these episodes. Today's episode has been made possible with direction from Josie and Hurd and Stephanie Aline, our facilitator, who set up the studio lights and uh, the sound system. Body music, by which will come in a few moments. The opening music, opening track is from Saptatandavam, Body Music by Cesar Dipara. Cesar has created the body music just for Yoga Express. In the last episode, we had a very unique experience. Those of us who are here in the studio today on the mats, we are back for more of that. We had such an amazing experience, we just couldn't let our special guest go. So we brought him back. And for those of you at home, who would like to join us one more time, I would like to reintroduce Harinam Singh Khalsa. Today we'll start first with our special guest. Harinam is a spiritual teacher and counselor. His credits are right there on the screen. Yogaheaven56 at gmail.com. After yesterday's experience, you might want to contact him, or you could go to his website, yogaheaven.com. Frankly, when we started out yesterday, Harinam, I, I was going through purgatory. I was not quite in heaven. But after I understood the way you explain things, after I understood, for instance, holding the postures is about true grit, it made more sense and I got better. Now, before we move on, before I have Harinam say anything, and I know he has an answer for my problem right here, and I know that's working in your mind, I'm going to reintroduce Ron Thomas to my extreme right and Sarah Torres. Sarah is an up and coming actress. Well, actually, she's not just up and coming. You've done a lot of roles, right? I've Sarah's done a lot of modeling small actress. Stuff, not the really big extra work. Right. I don't like your army fatigue. Thanks. <laughs> it I is think nice. I said it's it was such a challenge, I might as well get in the mood. And Sarah had never practiced <laughs> yoga before you came on Yoga Express, and you're, no. now you're quite a yoga addict. Quite safe to say that, right? Yeah, I like it. I want to explore it more. Welcome back to the show, Sarah. You and your tattoos are always welcome on our show. <laughs> She's got a little one very close to her. Ron Thomas is a producer here at Manhattan Neighborhood Network. Ron, what's the latest theme on your show? Hmm. What did we do last week? What did we occupy Wall Street? Occupy Wall Street? Yeah. Why is everyone occupying Wall Street? Okay, we won't get into that. We want to get stay in this yoga heaven. But yes, there are a lot of people out there. I think they need to come and experience Kundalini Yoga. They'll find some We're pieces. teaching there. We're teaching there, actually. You are? I am occasionally, and there are classes there all the time. This is like peace in the middle of all the madness. Go figure. Fantastic. <laughs> it's all coming hey, together. Isn't it That's to get right. the extra energy to get yeah. ready for battle. Harinam Singh Khalsa, spiritual teacher and counselor. Stay in touch with him. He will take you through some amazing journeys. Harinam, I do want to start with this question. Yesterday, like I said, what was the, what was the reason? Why could I not, in the first posture, I couldn't hold it. And the word grit, when you use that, I was determined to do the rest of it much better. What What is, is that something to do with the energy that you're sharing with us? Well, I think actually, if, if you were to ask that kind of personal question, which it was, I think I'd give the same answer to that I'd give to anybody. Right. My experience teaching this, well, again, just to very briefly summarize what I said yesterday, the reason we have the interest in these chakras, which are these different energy vortexes in your right. being, right. they really do reflect your strength in any one of those areas, kind of reflects how you are as a person. Right. And like everybody, we all have... We're, we're stronger in some areas than others, and there's no lying. You're, you're, as I say, your chakras won't lie. Right. Right. right, right. When the mirror doesn't so lie, you the chakras don't lie. You know right. me better than so I do. Right. <laughs> so what that is actually saying is that you're not as strong down where we were at as maybe you'll find that some of the other things we do are actually pretty easy. And then for other people, it would be the other way around. I know people who could hold that for an hour, but you, you tell them to hold their arms up for 10 seconds and they can't do it. Right. So oh, it I kind see. of it tells you we something about them. So we all have that. And if it's, 
if it is a little difficult, it's just a sign, you know, maybe that needs a little of attention. I'm still hope for folks like me, then. There's, I think, a little hope, yes. <laughs> Even for Bono, yes. Well, what do you have planned for us today? Well, I thought we'd continue wait. our little journey up. You yes. know, it's, it's, it's like a little journey up the chocolate. It so, is. So the uh, last session, we were talking again about the first and, and second chocolate. And do you know what you like to join us? We were talking about the first and second chakra, again, the first chakra being security, uh, survival. The second chakra, uh, your, your ability to be creative and artistic, uh, and and sexuality. also sen sexual, we call sexuality, on even on a higher level, well, that's a whole other class, right. and sensuality and creativity. Right. Okay, now we're going to move up to some very interesting areas. The next area is, is here, we talk about the Manipura, Manipura. and the Manipura is, is kind of like you were talking about. It is. It's fire in the belly, right. and uh, you know now. Now that's my wheelhouse because I was born that way. So I'm a lawyer. Right. Uh, I've been involved right. in politics. I'm a minister. You're an accountant. Uh, I'm, a, I'm a financial planner. Uh, I I'm on stage a lot. Uh, that that's a person who's coming from there. Right. And what's the downside of that? I can be a control freak. <laughs> I can be pushy. And I'm from New York to boot. Right, right. <laughs> so that's, uh, I think all New Yorkers have a little of that. So we're all coming from Money here. Money so and, you know, and actually New York City itself is coming from the Lanapura oh, oh, oh. Chakra. Oh, is there Places right? have chakras as well. In New York City, New York City is, is like very third chakra. Exactly. Wow. Power, wait, what's third chakra? Power, money. Uh, that kind of, and it's not all a bad thing. It's just right, a right. certain type of energy. That gravitates. For those people, that energy gravitates towards them. They, it's they natural. It's natural, of course. It could turn for the bad if you're not centered. Imagine a person who's very attracted to power, control, money, but they have no heart. Whoa. Right. Well, right. we know about those kind of people. Yeah. You know? So this is an example. This is that energy. But it's good to have this energy because this will give you... Um, this will give you self-confidence. This is also about self-confidence. Right. This is this is about um, having direction in your life. So if you're strong here, you tend to have direction, self-confidence, and that's a very good thing. And have a well-defined ego, not an ego out of control, but I know who I am, I know what I was put here right. to do. That's all third chakra. Wonderful. Okay. okay. Fourth chakra now, 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 when we talk about the human condition, you know, most people, most people are still working down here. They're working. It's you know you always hear people go oh you know this life it's about sex and money and power. Well that's actually what it is sex money and power. That's your lower three chakras and sometimes in this life people are not actually much above that. They're not that's, moving up. They're not moving up. They're kind of and they say they're stuck. They're stuck there and it's not a very pleasant existence. It's it's kind of a scrambling existence. Now you're a little more evolved, and you can do this many ways through meditation, prayer, yoga, whatever conscious thing you're using. And now, or, or being an act, acting or any creative art, you're moving it up, and now we're into the Anahata. Anahata. And this right. is the heart Anahata. chakra. And the heart chakra is, well, it speaks for itself. It's your ability to actually receive and give love. Now, this is the start of what we would call spiritual development. This, this is this, uh, here and up. Now we're really becoming not animals anymore. We're becoming very enlightened beings. And our ability to love, to be loved, to open our heart, to be there to serve, to serve a higher cause, to serve another that person, uh, to be a parent. Right. Sometimes people say they, they are like really, they, they, they're really not very nice people, and then they have a child and something happens. A yeah, but what actually, actually happens is that this opens up. It wasn't open. Now it's open, and they feel like they can give unconditional love, which they never felt. But right. something's actually happening. So we want to open our hearts. And so part of doing yoga in the practice is you will find, no matter what type of yoga you're doing, in time you're going, you know, my heart's opening. And people will say that to you. Boy, you know, right. you seem to be more heart-oriented. But there's a reason. That's opening. So again, you know, we had our little journey down here, and now the journey is kind of moving up. And so we talked about this. This is power. This is love. But they're both important, actually. If, right. if you, you know, it's I just before we do the set, you need to revisit this. If you're all if people think if you're all hard, it's great. It's not all great if you're all hard. No. Because you're all hard, and then people can take advantage. Take advantage, of you. exactly. You know, you want to have thing. you want to have some balance yeah. there. Okay. Right. So, so you use people to tell you the condition of your chakras. The way people treat you. 
Of course, that's there. You know, again, if somebody if somebody's very kind, you know, they developed here. If you know somebody, you know, there's somebody, you know, you go into a bar, somebody's, you know, trying to pick up on somebody. You know, you know where they're coming from. They're so coming sure. from down here. What are, oh, wait, what are so that? how, he's, he's, well, he's, I think he's asking, because I was wondering, you didn't answer it. Like, all right, so we know how to read other people's chakras, but do we have to go by what they're saying? No. To know our own chakra? No, what I was saying is, I was, I was like joking about what people say about you, but actually what you would love to be is, be, the goal is that you're conscious enough. To know that you know. Chakra. Well, this is the whole purpose why we do any of this, is to be able to know ourselves. Right. That's the goal. The goal is that you know yourself, and that's a process. Right. So I'm kind of joking that if you're not at the point where you feel confident knowing who you are and where you're strong and where you're not strong. And most people have difficulty really admitting to themselves who they are. Yes. You know, I, I was just joking. If the people you trust and they're always telling you what a kind person you are, well, you know, there's something to that. You know, if they're, if this, if everybody's saying you're a control freak, New York, <laughs> if everybody's <laughs> saying you're a control freak, there must be a reason. But you pick up, yeah, but you yeah. pick up, you can pick up this signs, this signs. Right, because right. it's, it's constantly there. It is constantly, it's constantly there. there. If everybody's telling you you're a control freak, you probably are a so control I, freak. I have a question. So in the next couple of days, when you do this whole series for us, the mini series for now, and yes. we hope you'll come back to expand on that. But in the next couple of days, do you think? by then we'll be able to identify in ourselves what is our dominant chakra? No. <laughs> because, well, I mean, it could happen, but I think one of the things that uh, I have learned practicing over the years is um, give yourself a break, be patient. Okay, this stuff, no, I, you know I just saying? want to know about But people ask something. me all the time, people go, if right. I do is this, am I going right. to know? <laughs> well, you know, it could happen. But it may not. But right. don't hold your breath. It's, okay. you know, and I'm being honest. Well, but, no, but, no, I appreciate that. But, but I think it's very good for people to know is that if they're patient and they practice this, what's right. even better is that you'll see this slowly open to you day by day. And that's even better than having like a, an immediate realization of something. The journey itself is, is, is very, very beautiful. And to know yourself a little bit more each day is just a very beautiful journey. Oh, so. I can't wait. This sounds amazing. Yeah. I love it. Okay. All right. All right. All right. Now, how, now, help me out a bit. Yes. How, why do we have for time so I'll know how many minutes to do I this? think we have a, but Josiane, we have about 20 minutes. Is that right? No, 15. 15. 15 minutes. Okay, perfect. Okay. Okay, we'll have this time now. Now, this is a set for physical vitality. Now, you'll know right away when we're doing this what chakra this is going to be. This is going to be obviously for the third chakra. Right. Because you're going to need third chakra energy to even do this. And if, for instance, she yeah, was saying... Yeah, all your ab work. <laughs> if, no, right. like power. I was thinking... This is like core. core. This is core. core. Oh. This is a core power workout. But what is a core power workout? It is your... This is your... This is your... Um, uh, Anahata, this is your Manipur. fire. This is my Manipur. This is my, I'm sorry, this is the Manipur. This is your fire in the belly. This is your core. Right. And you have to be strong there. Okay, okay let's go. Uh, lie on our backs, and this is how it's oh, going to look. Maybe we'll put our heads to the camera. Okay, is that better? All right. Yes. All right. For the camera. Okay. Is that okay? Or Absolutely. Maybe? Okay. So, or, or maybe you will actually, one of you want to go sideways, so that would be good. So, another angle. One person sideways. Yeah. Okay. Is that good? Yeah. I mean, yeah, sure. I mean, maybe like this, so they can see what it looks oh, like. Oh yeah, the three cameras, and then we just ah, yeah, yeah. Okay. They well, pick us up wherever we Let me show are. this very briefly. I'm lying on my back. That's good. I'm That's lying good. on my back. Yeah. I got my hands under my butt. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna lift my heel six inches off the ground, and I'm gonna do scissors, mm -hmm. just like so. See that? I'm going back and forth. That's all it is. And all the power is coming from my navel point. Okay? Six inches. Six inches. Sarah, you've been doing ab workouts, girl. Keep yeah, going. you can see that Banu's cheating a little bit. She's got <laughs> she's got about too 12 high? inches. Because I know high? it's a little easier, easier to up, do right? it. Right. Oh wow. So six inches. <laughs> our beautiful model head on the floor. Oh, oh there we go. Okay, there we go. We got a football player. He's a tough guy. You You're can't right. break it's him. It's much tougher going lower, honey. It is, that's why that, that's <laughs> the point, Banu. That's the point. <laughs> Wow. Okay, guys, keep going. Keep going. In, in, enjoy Ron, the grid. Don't give up, Ron. Enjoy I'm the grid. <laughs> come on, come on. 
It's funny. I'm slowing Keep down. Keep your eyes. <laughs> now concentrate, concentrate, and get into this attitude that you're not going to be broken. And this is what I was taught. As you're doing this, this is what I taught. There is a difference between discomfort and pain. All these people now are experiencing what's known as discomfort. <laughs> and maybe Ron a little pain, but, well, but these two ladies thoughts. are very uncomfortable. <laughs> but they're not in pain. Pain is when you're injured and your body is saying, please don't do this, I'm gonna be in the hospital. <laughs> discomfort is, I hope this is over pretty soon because I really don't like this. Okay, and come Not on, 30 yet. more seconds, oh 30 more, come on, 30 seconds. <laughs> they don't know how easy I'm making it on in them. Usually uh, this is five minutes. I'm already so, sweating. I know, I know. Whoa. Come on, come on guys, come on. I'm adding seconds on. <laughs> okay, Stop 10 more talk. seconds, 10 Stop more seconds, talk, 10 more. Okay, inhale. Now exhale, put your legs down. And we're going to relax for a little bit. And the reason we, in Kundalini Yoga, and keep your eyes shut and feel what happened, and we often relax between exercises so that the exercise has kind of freed up some energy, it's created some tension in the body, and now we're letting that tension out and we're letting the energy flow. So a lot of times, this is a very important part of the set is actually relaxation. I think I'm catching it. Our young athletic model here is <laughs> this has a cramp. <laughs> But she, but she loves it. She loves she, yeah. it. She loves she it. She does a lot of ab workout. That's what. It's very Western. <laughs> okay, very good. Well, I told him this is this oh, a lot of this is uh, now. Okay, guys, now you enjoyed that so much. Heels up six inches and once again. Whoa. There we go. Once again. Oh, this is this. I'll never get invited back on the show. <laughs> so come on, six inches. Let's go. Oh, you're serious. Don't. No, no, I'm serious. Oh, let's God. go. Let's go. Make sure your name isn't Tuna. <laughs> <laughs> come on, come on, like let's go, right? let's go. Why do we have the palms under the butt? I'm giving you a break. Normally, oh my God. it wouldn't be under the butt. Now, if you don't want it under the butt, you don't have to. But is it But tougher? I'm trying to be kind to you. Oh, it's tougher without the palms. It's, oh. I think it's easier. I'm trying to give you a break. Oh, right, right. It's easier with the palms. Okay, my if, palms are staying there. Okay, you will see that I'm right. Come on, come on. I got to go back to my roots. Come on. <laughs> Stop the clock, somebody. No, but it gets to the point that you, it's a change in attitude. If it's right, tough, right, right. if it's tough, you're going, great, give me more. <laughs> then, then you start getting a strong nervous system. Oh, then yeah. people start looking towards you for strength. Is that because your body is shaking so much during this process? If it's shaking, <laughs> if it's, no, this is a great question. Keep up, keep up. I'm answering the question, but that doesn't mean you can stop. <laughs> okay, Sarah, the reason spot, no. your body is shaking is not because you're not in good shape. It's because your nervous system is weak. Oh. Okay, it's your nerves that are shaking. And by doing this, you'll strengthen your nerves system so you're doing yourself a favor okay 30 more seconds just when I thought we were done <laughs> no 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 so, so I'm nervous all the time because my nerve, that's right nervous. that's right you have a weak nervous system and but the good news is you can actually strengthen it come on come on 15 seconds by doing this that's right that's right by doing this wow she's scared I'm doing this every but the night. alternative is worse Wow, the alternative is, is having a weak nervous system. Right. right okay. Right. Relax down again. <sighs> okay, we'll relax down for a bit. Can a bit be a while? <laughs> Sarah, we have a 28 minute okay. show. Sarah just slipped me a twenty dollar bill. I, that's <laughs> <laughs> so only Sarah's allowed to stay. I couldn't. Well, I had been when I I met my teacher. I've been practicing hatha yoga for years with all these gentle stretches, and I met him for the first time. I go, what was that? <laughs> what was that? He put me through a lawnmower. <laughs> but he was a great teacher. How did you, how did you decide to switch yogas? Uh, I had an experience doing this that I could not forget. That's why. Okay, folks, you enjoyed that one so much. Now what we're going to do is we're going to start bicycling. Now, still on your back, same position, hands under the butt, and I want you to start bicycling 
as if you're pushing and pulling. So one knee to the chest, the other out. There you go. So this is kind of a push-pull. Push-pull, push-pull. Push-pull. All the way out. So the, the uh, leg, one leg is going all the way out, the one's coming into the chest. Circular motion. Uh, no, more, more of a push-pull. Oh. It's bicycling, but a little bit more of a push-pull. And what I want you to do when you do this is invoke your willpower. That's, oh. Where is the willpower? The willpower is in your Manipura. third chakra, the Manipura. Uh. So put all your intention there. That's pretty good. <laughs> That's really good. That's good. Well, that's where you're strong. So uh, you should you should just keep up and just invoke your will. It's like when you work out, you know. That's it. Get to the next, by push, push. Push, push. Now, and that's not everything we do is push, push, but now we're push, pushing. <laughs> <laughs> okay? There's a time for, you know, there's a time for everything. And there's a time for push, push. Okay, guys, 20 more seconds. Oh. Plenty more. You know, I tell everybody, you know, the faster you do it, the easier it is. If you're going super slow, it seems easier. This there you go. Now you go. There, she's like a train. <laughs> she's I a got train out of control. Okay. Almost. Okay. Inhale. And exhale down. It's going to be a good take. You're going to sleep like a baby tonight. <laughs> oh, yeah. I hope so. We're going to get a DVD of this. Everybody's doing very, very good, especially, you know, your, in some case, your first time through with this. So it's, you're doing wonderful. The push pull. Okay, once again, here we go, push pull. Here we go, uno, dos, tres, and here we go. You there feel you more go. in your abs, too. When that's right, well, longer. exactly, it's in your abs. That's where your third chakra is, that's core. <laughs> So maybe you want to slow down okay. when you do this. We got five more minutes. So boy, you got such a break here because I had all these hard things and the producers been really uh, saved you here. Okay, come on, 20 more seconds. And if you send for these, you will be shocked when you receive the scanned version of this class and learn that actually this is for five minutes. If you promise me some candy, I'll go faster. <laughs> <laughs> All right, 10 more seconds. Come on, do the best you can. Yes. You know, this is what we say in life. Start well, go well, and finish well. <sighs> Inhale, and exhale down again. <sighs> Okay, come hopping up, come sitting in cross-legged position. Okay, because we, we don't have that much time, so I'm gonna give you two more things here, so let's, let's push them through. Interlace your fingers, like so. You're so young, you're half my age. <laughs> I feel funny, like, <laughs> okay. like woozy. And <laughs> okay, don't, don't be too woozy, okay. Interlace and push up. Okay, now push up, Hold the arms up and do what we call breath of fire. Very rapid breathing through the navel, from the navel point through the nose. There you go, very good. Oh, hey, you guys are great, there you go. You're off and running. I'll even do it with you, I love doing this. My train is slowing down. Uh, we gotta get more coal in that train, more in the engine, okay? <laughs> Very good, from the navel point, you can see, this is fire. If you're doing this right, you're going to sweat. And it's gonna make your body hot, it's gonna kick out all the toxins. I do this before I need to do anything requiring energy. This is a great energy booster. Oh, Okay, come on, keep on, keep on. Keep <laughs> on. It's such a workout. <laughs> I'm out of breath and I'm breathing. Okay, very equally. In, out, in, out, in, oh. out. Get those arms up. She's half my age, so she doesn't get a break here. Okay. Okay, and again, this is a shortened version. So inhale, exhale. Now fold your elbows and hold your opposite shoulders. Same thing. Very quick, it's like two or three. 
to hold the opposite <laughs> shoulders. My cross, speed is slow. Cross <laughs> your, there you go. Oh, opposite shoulders. shoulders. Opposite you shoulders. See, I feel so funny. I couldn't find my no. shoulders. And there you go. She, she can't <laughs> even. Find it's so tough. This <laughs> woman elbow. cannot even find like, your shoulders. Knew, what did he do to us? Knew, you're doing what I did. You got to touch your quick, shoulders. Quick, 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 quick. I can't reach there, girl. All right. So we have one oh, woman who can't touch way. her okay. shoulders, and the other woman has lost her shoulders. Uh, <laughs> okay, I'll show you. I'm a 60-year-old man. I know where my shoulders are. They're right here. And I'm putting all these young people to shame. It's embarrassing. I think it's this kundalini. What is it? <laughs> keep up, keep up, keep up, keep up, keep up. Another 30 seconds. Really breathe as fast and as hard as you can. You want to be sweating. I'm sweating. He's sweating. Okay. 20 seconds. Now you're coming to the finish line. 10 seconds. Blast Very off. good. Blast off. There we go. <laughs> My wow. funniest oh, yeah. now, hands oh, on wow. the knees, hands on the knees. Okay, no talk. Hands on the knees, eyes shut. Relax your breathing. And feel the energy you created within yourself. Very gentle breathing. Feel as if this energy is just entering every cell of your body. Okay, inhale. Exhale and slowly open your eyes. And I see the things the credits, the credits really, going, so there you go. About a minute. Whew, that was tough, <laughs> but I know I needed it. I needed that. Feedback, Sarah, how are you doing? How are Good. you? Good. <laughs> My body is shaking. <laughs> That's probably because I'm always so nervous. <laughs> no, but we survived, Sarah. Yeah. I think we need to give us some. Where's the back again? The shoulder? <laughs> and give I us even some see you have your shoulders. <laughs> I know where my shoulders are now. Thank you. Ron? You should do it for twice as long as we did it, man. That's right, man. That's the right That's attitude. Goal. I'm going to do it. I liked um, <laughs> doing the, the push pull bicycle motion. Right. Was that a little easier slower for you? because it, it helped target. Remember I was telling you, I'm trying yeah, to target yeah, my yeah. lower I ass. I went slow only because so. it was tough for me, but I didn't know. So are we supposed yeah, to Yeah, so she's better. up. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. no. <laughs> when you said it. She's right, but he said it's easy and very fast. I went really fast. Yeah, I, I, like, like, I, like, I like your style at the end. I, I can feel the power. Run. I feel the power. <laughs> I learned by new well, I'm very powerful. In closing, we'd like... <laughs> This is an amazing, amazing session. We'd like to thank Josiane Hurd, our director. Thank you, Josiane, for seeing us through this. And um, these episodes are taped in the studios of Manhattan Neighborhood Network. Thanks to Stephanie Aline for the studio.